Okay, my name's Kirk Anderson. The B Club guys call me Kirk OBO. Last week we had a meeting on starter strips and we did showed how to put starter strips in and how to wax them and that's what this video is about today. Backward beekeeping. Well, we're gonna put starter strips in and then we're gonna put some wax on them. All the starter strip is is a guide for the bees so they can draw their own natural comb. The traditional way is, is you get a piece of wax that's been imprinted with the size of that cell on it and you put the whole piece of wax in. But uh, that cell size is bigger than the bees draw usually in nature so we want them to draw the cell size that they want, whatever they determine. Plus we want it to be clean because most of the wax that is turned in to be melted down to make foundation with comes from hives that have been treated with chemicals. So I save all the wax so that I have my own clean wax to make the starter strips with. So I usually have a piece of old, you know, sandpaper from a belt sander because sometimes these grooves are kind of tight fitting. You can either use a stir stick like this one, which is just a simple one from the paint store, or you can cut a piece of cardboard that's 16 inches long and as wide as this stick and put that in there. I just press them in there and they get kind of snug. Then I take my trusty uh, putty knife and I, I'm going to break one and make it so that it goes clear across the strip. So I just take some of the wax that I got here and I brush it on. So you got a nice piece that goes across the whole frame. It's just a simple guide so they can draw their comb. They usually start in the middle or along here somewhere and then they just draw the comb down and eventually they'll fill the whole thing in. Full frame of comb when it's done. You know bees are pretty smart. We let them make most of the decisions. Okay well that's how you do starter strips. You know keep coming back to the blog behuman.blogspot.com because we're going to have a lot more videos so you can really learn how to do backward beekeeping. Stay tuned. Backwards is the new forwards. <laughs>